left. Hi. I'm glad you could come over. You know, we must have ESP going on between us, because I was just going to call you. <laughs> Good. Can I get you a cold drink? Sure. How about some of that great lemonade? Okay. I guess you're really excited about the big game. You better believe it. Greg's really up for it, too. I'll bet. Means a league championship. I hope you won't mind if I root for Westdale. Wouldn't have it any other way. Oh, my goof artist. Coach called a special session for team photographs. I completely forgot. Can I take a rain check on that lemonade? Sure. I hope you understand. I understand perfectly. Hey, get this. The paper picks Fairview to win by three points. <laughs> they only knew about the phony playbook. Hey, boys. Hi, Dad. Hey, Dad, want to win a bundle? Bet on Greg's team to clobber Fairview. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, listen, I hear you pulled a fast one on Fairview. You mean on that freak Jerry Rogers? Yeah. No, no, I mean on Fairview. Don't you see you're operating on Jerry Rogers' level now? What do you mean? Well, look, he stole your playbook. And if it had been the real one, his team could win dishonestly, right? Right. Okay, now Westdale can win dishonestly because the playbook is a fake. I never thought of it that way. Me either. Ditto. Well, boys, it just seems to me that um, a victory's only gonna mean something if Westdale beats Fairview in an honest game. Hmm? And I'll bet your coach would agree, too. Hello. Hi, Jerry. Greg Brady. Ah. Oh. Hi, Greg. What's up? Look, I'm calling about that playbook you swiped. Are you kidding? Me swipe your playbook? I'm just trying to do you a favor, Jerry. Some favor? Calling me a crook? Oh. <laughs> Let me put it this way. The book's a fake. I made up every play in it. I said I didn't take it. But even if I did, why would you be telling me? Because it's not fair to your team. Look, man, the books are phony. You're the phony, Greg. But thanks for the phone call. Westdale killed him. 20 to 7. Marvelous. They clobbered him. Jerry Rogers didn't even finish the game. The coach benched him in the first quarter when he found out about that phony playbook. We won fair and square. Right. Wait till you see what we're going to have for dessert. Oh, good. I'm ready for that. We're going to celebrate the big victory. <laughs> oh, Alice, that is beautiful. Hey, Alice, what if Westdale had lost? Oh, that's simple, Mr. Brady. <laughs> Here she goes again. <laughs> we would have settled for this. Uh -huh. <laughs>